Peter Ollis. Thank you very much, Mr Speaker. I'm grateful to my honourable friend for that reply. The £150 disability cost of living payment is indeed welcome, but those living with a disability pay more on heating costs as they are invariably less mobile and spend longer, if not the whole day, in their homes. As the honourable members for Bootle and Bexley Heath and Crayford have mentioned, Parkinson's UK estimate this additional cost at £1,200. Can my honourable friend set out what the government are doing to advise and help to those with a disability to bridge this funding gap? Well, what I can certainly offer is for my honourable friend to join the meeting that I've already agreed to in the earlier um, exchange, and I would certainly be keen to hear his insight and input on this issue. And it's important to set this £150 payment in the context of the wider package of support that's being provided, that £900 cost of living payment, the £300 pensioner payment, obviously the support that's being provided through the energy price guarantee, as well as that discretionary support. But I do think it's right, particularly um, with reform in the offing from April 2024 um, around energy um, support, that we do look at this issue in the round. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Number 17. Mr. Speaker, my honourable friend is a great champion for his constituents.